Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo, and today I'm sharing all kinds of decor and treasures I've been picking up while shopping. So I have been shopping and I've picked up things from all over, some stores that I am used to that I go to a lot like Walmart and Target and Ross and a few new stores. So there's a place called Dee Dee's, a place called Burke's. I've been to a few thrift stores and I even have picked up some more furniture and large pieces from Facebook Marketplace and offer up in my local area. So it is an eclectic haul. Let's jump right in. I'm gonna show you guys a couple things I picked up from Target and then we'll get through each store. So you know what they say about the best plans? Well. I picked this up before the 4th of July thinking I would get a chance to put some plants in it, something really cute, throw in some flags. Yeah, that didn't happen. We had guests, so that got put on the back burner, but it's $5. I can think of a ton of ways to use this in decor. It's just a little picnic basket, but I'm gonna switch it up and I'll be sharing all kinds of ways to use this in your decor for each season over on Instagram. And excuse the white background, I'm still filming in our master bedroom because it's empty and um, I'm getting to the stuff on the walls that is next on my list. Also in the Target dollar spot, I found this and I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it in the kitchen or in the bathroom drawers, but you guys know I'm in the middle of putting the whole house together. So any kind of organization I can get for a good deal I'm gonna pick up. I wish they had more. They are only $5 a piece, but this was the only one. Now I have been eyeballing a few larger items. So let me turn the camera around real quick and show you some of those. So as you can tell, there's a lot of large items. If you hear anything in the background, there's just maybe a few construction trucks going by. We are in an area that's getting developed. So you're gonna hear that a little bit. Um, for Target, I got one of these bath caddies. I think I'm gonna use this in our shower just for some storage. And I think I've decided on our mirrors for our master bath. I have loved this mirror since I saw it. It's by Threshold. It is called the Golden Pretzel. I love that detail right there with the curve. So I did pick this up when there was a chance to get, I think, 10 or $15 off and all I had to do was do an online order and then pick it up in store. So I ended up getting it for, I believe, $50. So that was about $15 off price. Then I found this one. I think this was Facebook Marketplace. I know I have seen this mirror in Hobby Lobby and I picked it up for 20 bucks. So I thought it was a great deal. And then I found these also on either OfferUp or Facebook Marketplace. They're from Target. They have them in the store right now. And I believe they're like $65 and she was selling them the pair for 30. So I really wanted them and I was planning on picking them up at full price. So why not pick them up at half price? And then we've been needing furniture. So I have three tables and I got them at three different places. This one is actually from World Market and I paid $12. It was at a private thrift store. I knew I liked it when I saw it, but then when I saw that it was from World Market, I knew why I liked it even more. So, so just a nice little side table. Probably will go in the guest bedroom. And then I found this one. I believe this was either Facebook Marketplace or OfferUp. And I did pay $20 for this one. I have been looking for something like this between our couches in the living room because our dog likes to be sort of in the living room but watching me in the kitchen and his little dog bed fits perfectly in there i am probably going to refinish it and then this one i paid 2.99 for so i thought for sure it was going to be broken when i saw the tag there's nothing wrong with it I think it'll go well in our guest room. It's just another side table. We'll have a queen size bed in there. So I think I can make those two go together quite well. And there was no beating the price. And then at a Goodwill in the area, I actually found this chest. It has someone else's last name on it, but it'll work well. 
it is on wheels and we need a few coolers here especially with the amount of shopping I'm doing out of the area and a few more treasures from the thrift store so I just love this one basket I'm totally gonna ditch that bow but it was $2.99 and yes I'm already thinking of fall and if you have seen any of my Halloween decor you know I like to pick up wooden black cats and Someday I'm envisioning having a lot of them in a collection. I'm probably going to be revamping this one, taking off the jeweled eyes, sanding it down. Just very primitive. I think this one was, oh, it was $2, so $1.99. And then at another thrift store, I found this. And these can be like $5 in places like Home Goods right now. And I'm probably going to use it on my vanity for some hair ties and stuff. It was 50 cents, so I thought that was definitely worth it. And then I got this guy at another thrift store, private owned charity thrift store. And it was dirty, so I gave it a good cleaning, but I love it. And it was $2. And then not from the thrift store, I actually picked this up for my son's room. It is from Home Goods. So he actually rides a unicycle quite well. He loves mountain biking and volleyball, so I'm thinking of ways to just put little personal touches on his bedroom. It was $19.99, and I think this will be really nice for his bedroom. So if you caught the first haul that I did here in Texas, you saw a lot of curtains and curtain rods. So I couldn't find the curtains I really wanted for my son's room, but I have finally found them. They came in stock. They're from Walmart, and they are a blackout eclipse curtain so we're going to be getting our blinds next week I'm super excited but I really like this one because it's sort of a jersey looking gray and I just like the texture for his room with the white walls I'm trying to add pops of texture and color everywhere and then I went to Dee Dee's and Burke's and I'm not familiar with these stores I think I went to a Dee Dee's when I was I don't know like 20 years old, long time ago, and they had some really affordable things. So this lampshade, I thought was really pretty. It's sort of that muslin texture and color, so not bright white. It's gonna add a little bit of pop. And it was only $5.99, and it's a good size lampshade. So if you have, I think this one was from Burks. If you have one of those in your area, let me know. I'd love to know if you check it out often. Is this a place I need to be going to? They didn't have a ton, so I was just happy to find that. I also came across a few things for the house, so I need organization. They had these for $5.99. I'm envisioning this in our lower cabinetry for cutting boards and large baking sheets, things like that. And for $5.99, you cannot beat that price. And that kind of goes with this, which I'm so picky about the silliest things. I probably waste way too much time on them, but I shared this in a Walmart shop with me, the sponge holders for your kitchen sink. I'm very particular, so I wanted a black one I knew exactly what I wanted and I wasn't gonna pay eight dollars like the one at Walmart which wasn't even black so I found this one also at Burke's and it was all of $5.99 it's by Cuisinart it's a really nice black matte finish now for the things from Ross the last organizer <laughs> I believe that I'm gonna share and it was also $5.99 and this is going to be used for probably separating my plates in my cupboard so I thought this was really nice very heavy-duty looking it's by Master Chef and it was only $5.99 and I should have picked up two they had two but it was slightly off balance I'm probably gonna need another one so I'll be on the lookout and thank you all who mentioned looking for things like um, these they're dish mats at Ross 399 it's very large so I'm definitely gonna go with the drying mat on my counter it's gonna be a new setup for me it's something I'm getting used to so I've been running to Ross a lot for the bathroom and all kinds of decor that I don't need but I want so I found this I actually found two 
I really wanted them both, but in actuality, I'll probably only use one. The price was right, and I really like the look of it. It is a table runner. It's very long. It's 72 inches, and it was $9.99. This matches the rug I picked up and hauled before we even moved, but I hauled the rug for this house. I shared it. It's from Costco, so if you remember seeing that, then you know that this really goes well with that. It does have the fringe there on the end, and I think I know what I'm gonna do with that, and I hope it doesn't upset you guys, because it's gonna be a bit of a departure from my normal decor style. I also found this blanket, and I love lightweight blankets. I love naps, I need naps, <laughs> and I like to just have stuff like this around for napping, and just honestly for the texture and for decor, so I could see this maybe hanging out of a basket or on the back of a piece of furniture. It has that chevron in it, but it's still super neutral, and I'm looking to bring in as much texture as I can. And the next thing is actually for our dog, Pogo. So our dog is little, but he acts like he's littler than he is and he doesn't like to have to pick his toys out of any kind of container. So I saw this at Ross, it was $9.99, and I thought it would be perfect because it has a lower lip right here. I've seen things like this at Target in wood in the kids' bedroom decor section, but they were pricey. So this was $9.99. This is the larger one. They had a smaller one for $6.99, but I didn't think it would be big enough has the handles on the sides, and I think this will be the solution to my problem. So I love the shopping here, but I think the thrifting here is even better. They have Goodwill, Salvation Army, but they have a lot of private thrift stores, and there are some great prices in there. So my daughter's friend was here to visit, and they both love thrifting, so we spent a lot of time doing that, and I came across quite a few great things to share with you guys. So my daughter wants to put a little more green in her room and we found this. It is a pillow cover. So it is sort of like a suede and it is the perfect green. It matches the curtains in her room that we just hung and it was $3.99. And this isn't life changing at all, but I was excited to find it. I use cotton rounds every day and it was $1.99 and I think it was half off. So it ended up being just a buck and it's heavy acrylic. So I'm gonna use this in my bathroom on my vanity and right after that we're at another thrift store and I found this Ooh, and I love it it's glass so this was five dollars comes with all of these beaded marbles I'm probably gonna use these in the bottom of my pots of succulents and um, I think I'm gonna do either q-tips or cotton balls in this and I think they go well together and speaking of my succulents so this was $2. It's originally from Ikea and it is a pot. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it inside with faux succulents or outside with real ones, but I just liked it. Of course, you guys know I love the black. And speaking of that, at the same thrift store, they had this and it is an item that was from Target. So it is by that brand. What is that considered? Room essentials and it has a wooden lid. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna use this yet, but could definitely be some sort of canister, could use it for storage. And it was two bucks. That seems to be what this store does. This was also $2. I had been looking at them at Target and Walmart and Home Goods, and they're like 10 bucks to hold your toilet paper. So. I am probably going to paint it as a dark brown. I'm probably going to paint that black, but that is a quick fix and a way to save a couple of bucks because I'm really good at spending them right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I'm picking up for our house and all of my little treasures that I now get to go put away. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you back very soon.